hello and welcome to my new guitar tutorial and this time it's about the song The Fade Out Line and yeah uh, it's from uh, there's a re version from um, The Adventure and also uh, one from Folk Kildeer and The Short Straws yeah and I think uh, both is very equal so I will show you uh, how to play this song now and yeah we need uh, the f uh, capo on the fourth fret for this song um, yeah, that's because that's uh, easier. We could also play it without capo, but uh, I think with capo it's uh, much easier. Yeah. And now we start. Um, the first chord we need is uh, an A minor. Now I will explain you also the how to play the bass line and together with the chord A minor. So uh, the whole uh, uh, first you only need the, this chord A minor. So um, the bass line is like this. Um, song you have to play this and yeah we uh, for this we uh, need um, first um, it's only played on the two uh, deep strings on the A and the E string and we start with the deep E string and we play um, this uh, string two times And then we go up to the third uh, fret on the on the E string, but this have to has to be uh, very uh, fast. So like this. And because um, I played uh, a little bit slower for you now, like this, and then we need the A string. So two times the E, then the G, and then the A string. And if you have to play it uh, very fast in the song, um, we don't play this uh, the G like this. We go, we just put our finger on like this. So we play two times the E, and then we put our finger or our third finger on the G. Just a moment. Yeah. the A string. So if you want you can play it like this or you play it like this. Just uh, yeah if you put, uh, play it like a normal or not normal. And now um, we uh, need um, the second finger on the uh, second fret on the A string. It's a uh, it's an uh, H and uh, B, I'm sorry. And then we go to the deep A string. So I play it slowly now. And then we need the A minor. So if we got this one finished, then there's coming one time the A minor. So that, so that you've got a chord also to the bass line. A minor is played like this. 
and then I play it again slowly. And then after this A minor it's only a short chord and so you have to go again back to the bass line and start again over with the DP string. And this is the, uh, the first, and if we go to the chorus, we need two other chords, and so we got this uh, A minor, and then the G major, and then the D major. And um, we play the bass line like this, then again. But then there's no, not coming the uh, A minor, just the G major and then the D major and then the A minor. In my opinion uh, it's a little bit similar to um, Knocking on Heaven's Door. Um, there's also the chords G major and D major and then A minor. Maybe it helps you to uh, know how to play these uh, chords. Because you always can remember on Knocking Heaven's Door. Nom normally there's the C major, but here the A minor. Yeah, and so we have to play the G major. Um, we got this one. Yeah. And we, you can also, if you are um, in this picking version, um, play it like this. And then, then there's a coming the bass line again. Slowly again. I play it like this. I play the, the, the deep string, the bass tone, the G, and then the high, the high strings. And then again G. This one, these both three chords. If the ba bass lines are too hard for you, just play these uh, three chords in the chorus: A minor, G major. Uh, I'm sorry, we start with G major, D major, and A, ma uh, A minor. Yeah. And you have to repeat this in the chorus. And then the first is coming again, and you have to play again the uh, the A minor. You can play play, uh, play a little bit uh, more rhythm, so you can do it like this. Mm -hmm. 
So you just uh, do this so that the strings uh, are not played and you've got this sound. Yeah, and there are some little uh, details in the song um, which the guitar is playing like this. So um, I'll show you now this one. Um, you can hear it some sometimes in this song. It's or just just this. And you have to play it like this. Uh, you put your f uh, first finger in the um, uh, uh, one thing. In the uh, fifth fret. So if you count uh, from the beginning of the capo, the fifth fret. And yeah, then you put. Put this finger down on the G and the uh, B string. Or it's played like this. Only so you need uh, the fifth uh, G and the fifth B. Play it one time. Then you go up. But now not like this, but like this. So it's the sixth on the G and the seventh on the B. And then you go back to it. You can hear it in the song and I think it's a really nice one. It's not too hard. Yeah. And I think that, th that that's it. So this song you have to practice a little bit and this bass line, but it sounds really good. I think so. And yeah, it's... Um, uh, it's really good to uh, to uh, to uh, try to play this song and yeah because you know it sounds very rhythm like uh, um, and the rhythm the bass line together with the chords yeah it sounds really great um, yeah and also the the chorus sounds great and the chords are not too hard so if the bass lines how i said are too hard for you just play the chords or uh, also in the first just like this always a minor and then the chorus g major d major and a minor yeah i hope you know now how to play the song and sorry for my bad english but i hope uh, you could understand it and yes Thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Bye.